My name is Bert de Winter. Um, I work from, for the Water Group from 2009, uh, first as IT manager, and from 2017, I became responsible in the management team of the Water Group for uh, innovation. My name is Thierry Brunel. I'm a partner at Delaware Belgium, responsible for data and AI team, and also on innovation, a new business model and business appliances. And I am the founder of the Dell 20. We have been revisiting our innovation process. We called it the Dell 20 because we had the ambition to become 20 key accounts of Delaware that collaborate, that co-create, that co-innovate together and learn from each other faster than the non-Dell 20 members. Uh, in fact, it was a big success from day one because the uh, early 20 adopters, they stayed very loyal. And for the moment, we have grown out the Dell 20 to a community of 75 participants who uh, constantly innovate, communicate and network together on innovative topics. We learn together on emerging technology, on the feasibility and on applied innovation. What is also unique is that participants from different companies and sectors can work together really in an open way and thus often in inspire each other to come up with new solutions. The main challenges are that uh, most of these companies, they stick on uh, operations, operations run better and they don't have the time to reflect on doing things differently. That's the first element in what the Dell 20 brings. So the, these people, they benefit from the fact that they can interact with other people in the network, giving them, in fact, interesting ideas on how they tackle certain problems within their companies. So in the past, some of these uh, events took place in the sector and they kept on in the sector, which is prohibiting people to see things that are tackled in a different way by other sectors. So that's one of the benefits of the Dell 20. Another benefit is really that we are catalyzing the innovation power and spirit within organizations by enabling that, by giving them, by granting them the 25 mandates catalyst budget. This way they are able to test and get proof of things or at least fail and because failing forward is also something we learn from. And so we are allowed to fail with these budgets, typically allowing to fail is not the mentality that most companies have and definitely CFOs don't like to watch. First and foremost, to get inspired by many new innovative data-driven solutions in various business sectors. Uh, this often provides inspiration to view our own problem in terms of a solution from a different business context. I also want to react to this, uh, Bert. Thank you for this input. Also from our side, there are big benefits and eh? because we are reducing the waste in innovation and people think that I really reinvented the wheel, which we uh, potentially want to avoid. Eh? Then the second thing is that us as an organization uh, within Delaware, we are also learning. We are learning from business acumen point of view and we are learning from emerging technology. If it really works, yes or no related to the business pains that customer have. So I think we all, uh, by joining the Dell 20, the Dell 20 members move faster and in a less costly way than if they would not have joined. Applying quantum optimization in figuring out the best location for sensors in the drinking water network to detect leaks. As you know, we maintain a network of more than 40,000 kilometers of pipes so in the quantum algorithms, they have the potential to calculate the optimal placement in a high performance way for such a large and a complex network. And it's really thanks to uh, Delaware Intel 20 that we got on this track. <laughs>